Hello everyone. Are you all ready for your English class? I am super excited today. The topic that I am going to be dealing with today is nouns. And you all have heard what nouns are from the very beginning. Today along with learning about nouns, we are also going to learn about what a common noun and a proper noun is. So let's begin. What is a noun? Nouns are words used to name some person, place, thing, living or non-living, animal, feelings, etc. The word thing here includes all objects that we can see, touch, hear, smell or taste and also something that we can think of but cannot perceive through our senses. Therefore, nouns are also called naming words. A noun answers the questions, what is it or who is it? So if you ask a child, what is there in your hand? The child says, toy. So the word toy answers the question, what? And therefore, it is a noun. And if you ask a child, who is it? And the child replies, it is my uncle. So the word uncle here answers the question, who? Therefore, uncle is a noun. Nouns are usually the first words that we learn as children. Let us look at some examples. Doctor, teacher, forest, home, apple, dog, pencil, baby, etc. are all examples of nouns. The girl and the boy read together. Girl and boy are nouns. We drove from school to the library. The words school and library are nouns. I forgot my backpack and my coat. The two nouns in this sentence are backpack and coat. Moving on to the kinds of nouns. There are many kinds of nouns but today in this class we are only going to discuss about proper nouns and common nouns. Common noun and proper noun. A common noun names any person, place or thing. Common nouns are the naming words that indicate the names of classes or categories of persons, places, things, etc. This means that a name given in common, that is a general name, to every person or thing of the same kind is called common noun. Remember one thing that common nouns may be of different numbers and genders. Next is the proper noun. A proper noun is the name of a specific person, place or thing. The word proper here implies particularly, hence Proper nouns can be defined as names of particular, definite or specific persons, places or things. One important thing to remember here is that proper nouns take the first letter of their spellings in capital. The names of days of the week, months of the year, historical places, schools, institutions 
organizations, religions and their holy texts and their adherents are all proper nouns. So, let us try to differentiate between common noun and proper noun. As you can see here, proper noun is a special name and common noun is a common or a general name. So, man is a common noun whereas Victor, Hugo and Walt Disney are proper nouns. Mountain is a common noun, whereas Mount Kilimanjaro is a proper noun. Ocean is a common noun, whereas Atlantic Ocean, Indian Ocean are proper nouns. State is a common noun, whereas Minnesota, California, Chhattisgarh are all proper nouns. Country is a common noun, whereas India, United States, Australia are proper nouns. Building is a common noun, whereas name of a specific building is a proper noun. For example, Empire State Building. Cat is a common noun, whereas if you give a specific name to your cat, example buttons or fluffy that is proper noun a website is a common noun whereas the name of a particular website for example english grammar revolution is a proper noun nouns that are both common and proper Consider these pictures of the sun, the moon and the earth. These are used both as common and proper nouns. Look at the following sentences. The sun is a star. The sun's rays come in through the window. The moon is the earth's satellite. The earth has two poles. I like the smell of fresh earth. Thus, we write sun, moon and earth beginning with capital letters only when we are talking about the star, satellite and planet respectively. Whereas, these are used as common nouns when they are being referred to in general and not the planets stars or satellites. Let us try to identify common and proper nouns. We arrived early at the station. The word station here is a common noun. January is the first month of the year. The word January is a specific name therefore it is a proper noun whereas month and year are common nouns. My cousin lives in New York. Because cousin's name specific name is not given therefore cousin is a common noun and New York is a proper noun. I like to ride on a camel. Which camel we do not know. So this is a general thing a general name therefore it is a common noun the baby is crying no specific name has been given therefore baby here is a common noun Paris is located in France both Paris and France are specific names therefore they are proper nouns That's all for today. I hope you have enjoyed learning about common and proper nouns with me. I will see you all in the next class. Until then, stay safe, take good care of yourself. Bye-bye.